Hello everyone, welcome to Easy Review and today we are going to discuss about the distance formula. We will explain in detail how to derive the distance formula and we will also explain about uh, calculating the distance between two points in a 2D plane. So the distance formula have a wide range of application and the distance formula is part of the Pythagorean theorem. Now let's consider these two points in a uh, xy plane or xy graph. In this graph, these two and one represent this point. This two is the x axis and this one is the y axis of this point. Now this second point is represented by 3 2 and this this 3 represent the x2 and this 2 represent the y2. Using distance formula we can easily find the distance between these two points and the distance between these two points is represented by this d. Now look at the distance formula. We know that the distance formula is d is equal to under root x x2 minus x1 whole square plus y2 minus y1 whole square. We will simply subtract this x1, this 2 from this x2. So we will have 3 minus 2 whole square and this y2 we know is 2 and y1 is 1. So 2 minus 1 whole square. We will get d is equal to under root 1 square plus 1 square which is equal to d is equal to under root 2 and finally we will get the distance between these two points as 1.41. Now this is the application of distance formula. Using this distance formula we can determine the distance between any two points in a 2D plane or in a graph. Now let's derive this equation. For deriving this equation, uh, let's consider these two points. This first point is represented by 2, 1 in which 2 is x1 and 1 is the y component of this, this point and this is making a right angle triangle. Similarly, this 3, 2 represent this bigger triangle. Now what we are going to do is we are going to simply subtract the x component of the smaller triangle from the x component of the bigger triangle and we will get a new x. So we will have x is equal to x2 minus x1 which is equal to 3 minus 2 is equal to 1. Similarly, we will subtract the smaller y of, or the y component of the smaller triangle from the y component of the bigger triangle. So we will have a new y is equal to y2 minus y1 which will be equal to 2 minus 1 and will be equal to 1. Now this pair of numbers 1 1 now this 1 1 represent a point in this xy plane and that point is uh, this. This is the point represented by 1 1 and this the x component is 1 and the y component is also 1. So we will have xy is equal to 1 1. Now this 1 1 point is also making a triangular shape and in this triangular shape this is the base, this is the perpendicular and this is the hypotenuse and this is a right angle triangle. So using Pythagorean theorem we can easily determine the distance d between this point and this origin. According to the Pythagorean theorem we know that this d square hypotenuse whole square will be equal to base square plus perpendicular square. Now taking under root on both the sides we will get d is equal to under root x square plus y square. Substituting the values for x and y we will get under root 2 and that is equal to 1.41. So we got the same result. Now if in this equation this d is equal to under root x square plus y square if we substitute the values of x and y we will get d is equal to under root x2 minus x1 whole square plus y2 minus y1 whole square and this is the distance formula. That's it. Thank you for watching and don't forget to subscribe easy to you for more videos.